Joey Chestnut, the Michael Jordan of professional eating, right now is not going to be appearing in the Nathan's Hot Dog Eating Competition, which, which goes down 4th of July weekend. Um, as Major League Eating, one more time, as Major League Eating, that's a, that's the brand that... MLE. Right, the MLE. Are they undrafted? They said this is like Michael Jordan then also <laughs> trying to represent Adidas. Well, behind the scenes, I guess, Joey Chestnut, the 16-time champ who once ate 76 hot dogs in 10 minutes, Ugh. I guess um, is now being sponsored by a plant-based impossible exactly stop it so (laughs) major league eating is not uh, happy about this which is court which of course is sponsored by uh nathan so they don't want him to participate because he is now being sponsored by a plant-based hot dog is this not insane eating so anti-veganism so serious yeah right you know it's so funny speaking of impossible foods who told this is this story is so great i love this hot dog eating competition um, so Impossible Foods told ESPN that they support Chestnut. Here we go. In any contest he chooses, and that, and I quote when I say this, meat eaters shouldn't have to be exclusive to just one wiener. So there you go. They're letting him eat as many hot dogs wherever he wants. Major League Eating is like, no, we want you all about Nathan's on the 4th of July. You know I have a theory. Yes, of course you have a theory. Okay, maybe this is a swing and a miss, but... Uh... No, I feel like this is all a big setup. This is a big marketing thing. We're three... You always think it's that. It's genius. Know, it's genius, I though. No, but here we are. We're three weeks away from the hot dog eating competition. Suspicious timing. And here we have this giant story. No one's talking about uh, Nathan's or Impossible Dogs more right. than right. right now because of this story. So... Here's my big theory. Again, could they're, be a swing and a miss. They're going to work it out. They're going to work it out right beforehand. And oh my gosh, Joey Chestnut is unbanned right before the competition. And all of this marketing will have been worth it. I have a theory based on your theory. Yes. Oh, good. It came to me that Impossible Dogs, which I never knew they made. I knew they made intos- Impossible Burgers and Sausage. I didn't know they made hot dogs. Yes. I think Nathan's is going to start carrying impossible hot dogs. Oh, a collaboration. I, and therefore, because you said, and therefore thus. The <laughs> Very smart words. Keep going. Keep going. Uh, you know, the fact that these but these brands are top of mind right now. It only makes sense. It only yeah, makes Joey, sense. Joey Chestnut is the brand. You got to have him you, at the you, contest. Yeah, there's no contest gotta, without the dude. You got to do anything. That's yes. po- it seems like the most like written in a conference room thing. You know what? Joey Chestnut's going to the dark side. He's going impossible dogs. Ooh, that's Let's good. Cancel him. It's good. Let's cancel him and then bring him back. Yeah.